Hello, my fellow Aldi addict. It's Jackie. It's another week. I'm back at Aldi. I am actually grocery shopping on Sunday because my husband can be home with the puppy. We're still not leaving her long times, and I wanted to make this stress-free, which means not leaving the puppy. So we're going to get in, do a week of grocery shopping and see what we get. And don't forget at the end, I will be sharing my meal plan and any recipe I'm using is linked below. Okay. They finally have the Oreos back. I'm getting these $2.85. I'm getting the salsa con queso for $1.99. And I also need tor tortilla chips to go with it. $1.95 baguette for bread, butter, and cheese for the dinner, $1.79. Weekly staple of bread, $1.29. Hey look, they have fresh herbs. That's awesome. I need cilantro, 85 cents. Okay, I'm gonna get three things of raspberries for lunches, $1.49 a piece. Okay, Brussels sprouts are on the list and they're on sale, bonus, $2.89. I'm actually gonna get these two cucumbers, 65 cents a piece. Lettuce for $2.79 a piece. I'm getting chopped kale, $3.49 for kale and red cabbage salad, my 11 year old's request. Eggs are $2.22, I need a dozen. Okay, $2.65 for a gallon of 2% milk. Cream for $4.69 for butter chicken, and then I need uh, whipped cream for $2.99. I'm making butter chicken this week, and I need two cans of diced tomatoes for that, 85 cents a piece. I love these beets, they're so good. I love them on salads, and I need more, $1.79. Okay, my son wanted celery for his vegetable and his lunches this week, so here it is, $1.69. Okay, the organic grape tomatoes are actually cheaper than the regular ones, so I'm gonna get these, $2.79 for our Greek bowls. We are having salads for some dinners this week. I need more croutons, $1.19. We are running low on this dressing, and my whole family likes it, so I'm gonna get it. It's just like Olive Garden, $1.99. That one looks good to me, too. Yum. Greek bowls would not be complete without Kalamata olives, two nineteen. Three seventy five for peanut butter. I almost forgot this, and that would have made my husband very sad because he's making muddy buddies. We're reaching way in the back to get brown sugar pop tarts, dollar seventy eight. My teenager's request. My husband's gonna make Chex Mix, and he's gonna make puppy chow, or he calls it muddy buddies. So I'm curious, do you call it? puppy chow or muddy buddies. Either way, I need two boxes of rice checks or rice squares, $2.79 each. I'm getting three energy shots for my husband, $1.19 a piece. I had to really dig for his flavor. We haven't had juice for a long time and my kids are not happy about it. $2.95 for grape juice and $1.79 for apple juice. I'll let them fight over which one we open this week. Okay, lots of home organization stuff still. Nothing super new, but they have lots of fun toys. They have a pogo jumper, bubble machine. Look at the little hoppers. Look at all these beanie babies. Like, is this one not the cutest? How adorable. Soccer goal, different outdoor toys. Lots of fun things. A little wheelbarrow. Plant stands. Oh, that's a cool cart. Different lights, I really like those. Arm, er, uh, slip covers for armchairs and sofas, that, those are pretty nice. Different cat toys, pet rain boots, that's funny. I finally have a dog, should I get her a rain jacket? That would be cute. Okay, I've never tried the Aldi brand conditioner, but I'm almost out and the one I buy normally is from Costco. And for $2.99, it's worth trying this before driving all the way to Costco. Okay, I need a tube of basil, $2.49. Love this stuff. 
I'm getting the size tortilla for quesadillas this week. $1.95, it's one of my favorite quick dinners. I used the rest of my corn oil last week, so I have no need for it this week, but I'm just replenishing. This is $4.85. I'm getting fettuccine for my family to have pasta this week, $1.99. $1.29 for beef broth. I'm making beef tips and I'm very excited about it. $1.79 for light brown sugar, just running low. $2.99 for sweetened coconut. I'm making a crustless coconut pie. My husband is needing semi-sweet chocolate chips for the Muddy Buddies or the Puppy Chow. $1.99. Okay, I'm getting stew meat to make my beef tips. Um, $5.49 a pound, but I'm gonna freeze half of it, so this will be two dinners worth. It's $7.91. Wait, nope, I'm gonna get the $7.41. We are always in need of hot chocolate, $1.25. I'm getting two boxes. Tons of ham, which shouldn't be a surprise with Easter next week. Um, different seafoods, of course. Mussels, those look new. And the mahi mahi fillets. Seafood jambalaya, black tiger shrimp. Those are some giant shrimps. Crab cakes, calamari, beef lo mein. Oh, leg of lamb. Interesting. Different frozen soups. Lots of pizzas down here. Mac and cheese bites. Still have the chicken schnitzel teasing me. Okay, the, my kid's favorite cheese is on sale again. I'm getting two more bags, $2.59. We'll use these for quesadillas and probably salads. They really like how fine it is. Sliced cheddar, $1.89. Okay, we have the chicken nuggets, lots of different potatoes, loaded baked potato pierogies, air fryer chicken, oh, steaks, okay. And they actually don't have a ton, oh, strawberry rhubarb pie over there, <sighs> yummy. Ice cream cones, rolls, $13.88, I'm going to get one, I've always said you guys have convinced me in the comments, and then once I finally went to do it, I was never able to get a strawberry rhubarb. So I'm getting it. I don't know when we're gonna eat it. The, oops, the date on it is still pretty far out. That one's really cracked, so I'm gonna dig. I'll show you what I get. Okay, I'm finally getting it. This one looks pretty good, $13.88. I'll let you guys know. I don't know when we're gonna have it, but it's a three pound pie. Lemon water, $3.85. Okay, cauliflower rice. We're having butter chicken, and I like to have cut my rice with this. Two oh nine. We're also having butter chicken two nights for dinner. Um, but oops, I get broccoli. I need a bag for each night. Ninety seven cents. The beef tips has a need for red wine, so I'm gonna get this Merlot for three forty five. And then I guess I'll have to drink the rest. My husband was so sad I didn't grocery shop last week because he really needed his vanilla pail of ice cream and we ran out, $6.49. I guess you could say this is the his and hers of our Aldi sweet tooths. They have none of my waters, which is too bad. They have um, different curry sauces here, tikka masala, they have butter chicken. I'm making my home name butter chicken, but those look pretty good, $2.99. They have lots of really pretty pans and cookware. I like these uh, basting utensils, pretty knives, stirring, lots of pretty things. A lot of it I think has been here for a while though. Okay, so my son's been with me the whole time. You guys didn't even know it because he's been so good and I told him he could pick one thing and this is what he picked. We've never bought these but they do look pretty good. They're $2.29. It's the milk chocolate with hazelnut. Good pick, bud. Here's everything I have. Any guesses on the total? As I'm in line, they have these cute garden tools and they have a weeder. I don't see any prices though. There they are, $4.49 and $16.99 and $4.99 for the fabric. Here are some other good Easter stuff as I'm in line. Cute little cupcakes, vanilla and chocolate. Yummy looking carrot cake, that's $7.99. 
seven layer dessert bars, frosted sugar cookies, and these are the ones I most tend to buy. I might have to get those. I haven't done my um, Easter hosting shopping yet. That's gonna be later. Okay, all of that was one forty five seventy six, and it's bagged. Yay! We're having quesadillas for dinner. This is very simple. My kids really like them though, and I'm gonna have black beans on the side. We're gonna have Greek bowls. My 11-year-old Elsie requested this. So basically, I have frozen chicken. I'm gonna season it, and then we'll have toppings galore. Everything from feta cheese and the kale and um, red cabbage salad, kalamata olives, beets. We have a Greek dressing, rice. So many good things. You basically build whatever bowl you want. We're gonna have pasta, salads, and a baguette. And with the baguette, my husband likes to butter it and use cheese slices. Very simple dinner again. I'm making homemade butter chicken. We have this with cauliflower rice, rice, paneer, and broccoli, and um, non bread. So it's a whole ordeal. My whole family likes it. My vegetarian obviously does not eat the chicken. And I like to have this and make it for two nights. So we'll have this two nights in a row. Then we're going to get carry out pizza. We've been doing that once a week and it works well. Um, just easy end of the week. It's a weekend, easy meal. And then I generally have salads with that. And then finally, as I was filming the end of my grocery haul, I realized that Easter is literally next Sunday and I didn't have it on my meal plan. So the beef tips that I was planning for next Sunday is just going to be moved to next week's meal plan, even though I bought all the stuff this week. I still need to shop for Easter. So you guys might be seeing another small Easter haul. We are hosting over here and I'm making cheesy potatoes. I'm going to make a dessert or two. And I'm also going to have all the fixings for pulled pork or shredded chicken sandwiches. I'm not sure which one yet. Um, I guess I need to get my button gear. I've, I just can't believe it's next weekend already. So uh, be looking for a little bonus haul, I guess, but this is the meal plan for the week. And if you want to see exactly how I do butter chicken, it's literally my favorite meal to make for the family. I get two nights out of it. It's so delicious and I absolutely love it. You can check out this video right here. Thank you so much for watching. Ciao down and ciao.